Ja, what was different about you guys' energy, even though tonight was the back-to-back? -back, um, did, did something just change overnight where you guys just kind of just saw everybody just say, all right, let's get it together and get it done? Oh, um, man, you know, just learning from, you know, last night. Uh, even though, you know, we was able to, you know, come out with a win, um, you know, in that third quarter, uh, you know, we, we allowed the team, you know, to, to get back in the game and also, you know, take the lead, so... Um, my mindset tonight was just, you know, play a, a full 48 minutes, um, which, you know, we try to do every night. And I feel like, you know, we're, we're making good strides. And tonight, um, after winning, you know, every quarter um, shows, you know, good sign. Megan Triplett. Ja, to see, I mean, we've, we've talked about it all season long, the depth that you guys have and that next man up mentality. Um, but to see John Conchar come off the bench and have the performance like he did, he talked the other night about how a lot of you guys have always given him the support and just kind of motivating him to just get to the rim. But what is it still like to kind of like, are you surprised at an 18.6 rebounds, three assists performance from him? Nah, I'm not at all. Um, you know, seeing him, you know, uh, you know, when we, we first started, you know, playing the scrimmages and stuff, um, he was doing, you know, the, the stuff he did, you know, the past couple of games. So, like he said, you know, I was one of those guys, you know, to show him with support. You know, I used to, you know, kind of get frustrated when, you know, he would pass up shots and wouldn't be aggressive because, you know, I know what he's capable of. And, you know, I've seen him, you know, uh, do the stuff he did tonight. So my, my message to him was just, you know, go out there and play freely. Like nobody, you know, will, you know, yell at you, be mad at you for, you know, being aggressive. Um, and as you can see, when he, when he plays aggressive and, you know, look for his, um, it helps the team. So, Clayton. Hey, John. Um, congrats on the win. Just, you know, there were obviously times over the last few weeks that you, know, you guys had a lead, and then sometimes you'd let a team back in. The intensity might drop. How do you kind of bottle what you had tonight where you just kept on the gas pedal going into these next few games into the stretch trying to get the eighth seed here? Um, I feel like, you know, tonight is just shows us, you know, um, we're capable of, of doing it. Um, you know, we just got to continue to try to, you know, play um, a full 48 minutes. Um, that's really the, the message. Terry Davis. Hey, how you doing, man? I'm all good. Hey, man, it seemed like, you know, you guys, it was almost like a business trip. You know, it was, it, it, you're like, you went out there having fun, out there laughing and stuff. It's like you was out there to to set a tone and say, look, even though we don't have our guys, we're going to do a mission. Is that the way the mindset y'all have going into the last three games? A hundred percent. No matter, you know, who we have out there on the floor, you know, we all have to be locked in, um, be ready to play. And, you know, when, when we handle our business and, you know, do what we're supposed to do, we are, we are able to, you know, have fun and, you know, laugh. Because, uh, you know, it, it kind of, you know, most likely always result in a win. So, um, you know, but – we always got to have fun, you know, with, with uh, what we're doing. Um, you know, we're blessed, you know, not too many people, you know, have the opportunity we have um, on making it to the league. Um, so, you know, you got to enjoy every bit of it. But uh, the laughing and joking is, you know, really is us off the court. So, you know, we were just being ourselves tonight and also handle business while doing it. Adam Tyke. Hey, John, you guys clinched a spot in the play-in tournament yesterday and picked up another one tonight. Are you letting yourself feel a sense of momentum and excitement for that now that you've secured your spot? Um, job's not finished. Um, even though, you know, we se secured a spot, or, you know, really doesn't mean nothing. Um, we still got to, you know, finish out strong and handle business in the play-in tournament. So until we do that, uh, you know, job's not done. Time for one more. Evan Barnes. Yeah, Dylan said that last year's game against Portland, the playing tournament kind of motivated you guys because you guys had been in that situation and you know that that game kind of was a teaching moment for you all. So is that kind of, as the stretch goes down, is that kind of another thing that kind of motivates you guys just to get back to show what you guys have learned since that game? Um, 100%, you know. Um, I can speak for me. Um, you know, that game still, you know, sits in the back of my mind, um, you know, we're thinking on, you know, uh, coming close to that playing tournament. And, but like, you know, we all motivated, um, you know, most of our team, you know, uh, was with us during that time. So we all know, you know, um, how it felt to, you know, play in a game like that and also, you know, come up short. So I feel like, you know, we're extra motivated, you know, we just got to handle business. Uh, simple as that. Thanks, John.
Well. Next, we will have Tyus Jones. 